Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're doing well today. So I thought I'd film a few days with me. I just got in from work and I just thought I'd pick up the camera. I'm actually on leave tomorrow, which I feel like I've not booked a day off work like all summer. I really feel like I worked through all of summer. I probably didn't, well, I didn't, but I really didn't put that much leave. So I've got tomorrow off. So I thought, you know what, I'm gonna film it. I'm gonna film doing something and just be a bit more interesting because I'm always that I'm actually not, but I just feel like my vlogs are always at home. So I've got the day off tomorrow. Thought I'd start a little vlog. So I just got home from work. I look a little bit disheveled. I'm a bit just like sweaty and greasy. Everything's just like all over the place. Like, you know, we just got so much to sort out. I've got all like returns to do. The suitcases are out already. Like I need to like, well, I don't actually need to pack. It's too early to pack. But like the suitcases are out and ready and I need to do washing. And you know, just before holiday, like even though it's exciting, I do feel a bit like discombobulated. Like I just need everything to be neat. And it's not right now. I think, um, oh yeah, I think Harrison just got home. But, oh, look at this pillow that I got. Actually, my mum got it from, for me, um, from Nex, which I'm so happy with. Let me put the light on because it's getting kind of dark. It's still in the wrapping, but I really want to decorate for the different seasons because I just think it will be nice, really. How cute is this little cushion? Obviously, I'm going to put it in the cupboard away um, until, I don't feel like it's autumn yet. But it's from Nex and it's like um, a cute little oblong cushion. It says, hello, pumpkin. It's got like toadstools and rusty um, pumpkins. And I just love it. And obviously my sofa is orange as well. Um, yeah, so please then I actually have like literally the exact same cushion, but like a Christmas version, which was from a garden centre. It's literally the exact same shape and colour, but it's got green um, trees on it. So yeah, that's from Nex. Really happy with that. I'm going to put it in the cupboard and then get it out probably like the end of september when it gets a bit colder although today it's been freezing and then look at our new plant look at the size of it so you basically had this plant but it came up to like here and it died to be fair it wasn't actually my responsibility like when we got the plant i was like harrison this is for you because i don't know what i'm doing and it died but yeah it came up to like there so he ordered this one which again i don't know the name of this plant but it's the exact same plant um from the website called The Plant Drop, and he thought he ordered the same size. Look at the size of this plant, like I don't even know if it's gonna like translate in a video, but these are like really tall ceilings and it's really tall. Like when the man delivered it and I opened the front door to this plant and I was like, what is going on? Um, it, it looks so much better, I think. Like it fills up the corner a lot better and obviously like it fills up the wall more. Um, let me turn off the light and see, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it better in the light like i said it's getting a bit dark now but it's so tall but i absolutely love it i think it looks so nice and it really filled out the corner better um i was just snapchatting my friend emily who has just moved out and she's like buying all new things for her flat and like obviously sending me hauls and like talking about what she's buying i'm like it, it really makes me like i'm so easily influenced because now i'm like now i want to buy loads of home stuff and i want to paint and like now I want to spend money, but I don't have the money to spend because I'm going away. And I don't have spare money to spend on stuff. But I think when we get back, there is things like we, there's a lot of like paint and like things like that around the fact that we want to do. So I'll probably do like vlogs like that after I get from holiday and I'm like in the autumn mood. And I feel like as well in autumn and winter, you're at home so much more. Um, so it's nice to just have everything feel refreshed. I need to like, you know, we just need to sort out your cupboards and like everything's just got a bit messy again, like my hair drawers, my makeup drawers and stuff. So I need to do all of that, but I'll do that when I get back from being away and then like be fresh for the autumn time. We've been meaning to replace these orange blinds for how long have we been here now? I think nine, 10 months. Still haven't done it. So that's another thing that we need to do on the list. So it's a lot to do. But anyway, I thought that was a really big tangent. I don't even know how I got onto that. I think because I was showing you my new autumn pillow. My hair. Oh, I'm, so I, I'm like I said, I'm off work tomorrow. Again, ignore these lights. Like we need to replace. We actually had the wall lights. We've had the wall lights for nine months and we just haven't replaced it on the wall. I don't know why I'm walking around so much. Sorry, I'm probably making you dizzy. I also get my nails done on Saturday. I'm so excited because I actually don't mind the plain nails. Like I think... After I get my nails done this weekend, after that, even though it's like autumn colours, which is exciting, I might just go plain because it saves me money and I actually don't mind. Like, I feel like it looks clean. <sighs> anyway, I really am rambling now. Time for dinner, my favourite part of the day. I'm starving today. I don't know why I'm so hungry. But for dinner, this is what I've got. How unreal does this look? This is a HelloFresh 
prawn and tomato risotto with leeks, cheese, and chili flakes. Oh, that looks unbelievable. Thank you so much to HelloFresh for sponsoring this part of the video. I can't believe we're now talking about autumn and getting into autumn, but now that we're getting to a new season, like I need a, a fresh new routine. I wanna stay healthy, I wanna stay on track. It's so easy when it gets colder to just like eat like a crazy person and hibernate. So I feel like HelloFresh is a great way to keep a really good routine still. If you guys haven't heard of HelloFresh before, they are a food subscription service. The food gets delivered straight to your door. Honestly, I've been using HelloFresh since I first started using it in 2020. Um, and I just love it. It's so easy. The food options that you can pick are amazing. I feel like you can really switch up your dinner ideas, your meal ideas, and so many amazing recipes. Plus, while still being affordable as well, which is obviously really important at the moment. Basically, you can pick out your recipes every week. So I've gone for a risotto this week. I've also got a, a chicken Thai green curry to have this week as well, which is unbelievable. So you can pick all different recipes. They've got different categories. Like they've got calorie count ones if you're trying to lose weight. They have family friendly options if you've got a bigger house to feed. They've also got like speedy ones, which are really handy. I had a speedy noodle one last night, which was unreal. There's so many recipes to choose from and it's really flexible. I love that you can pull certain weeks, you can skip certain weeks if you want to have a few weeks off, if you want to have a break, if you've gone on holiday. You also have the flexibility to pause it um, and cancel your subscription when you want as well, which I think is really important to not feel like super tied into something every week. If you do like the sound of HelloFresh or if you want to try it for a while, I do have a really good discount code with them. If you scan this QR code here, you can get 60% off of your first box and then 25% off of your next eight boxes which is crazy it's a total of nine discounted boxes like i said the recipes make you feel like a chef and you're going to be able to get nine discounted boxes a good way to get you back into a good routine for autumn now that unfortunately summer is pretty much over i will link the website and the discount code in the description box below as well if you're interested but i'm going to start cooking up my risotto which honestly i'm so excited about i love risotto and it's so easy and like i said it, it's like recipes that i wouldn't normally go to the supermarket and buy but then i cook them at home following a recipe card and i feel like a chef i'm going to start with this prawn tomato risotto i am gonna it's got garlic cloves in it so i'm just gonna go and ask my boyfriend to cut up the garlic cloves because i love garlic but I, I hate touching it and I hate my hands smelling a bit. My finished prawn tomato risotto. It smells so good. I'm just going to do a quick little taste test. So good. I love how the risotto has like a little bit of a bite to it as well. So nice. If you guys are interested in making meals like this or do you want to check out HelloFresh, then like I said, I will leave the website in the description box below along with my discount code if you want to get nine discounted boxes. And a big thank you to HelloFresh for sponsoring this part of the video. I'm now going to go tuck into my risotto and watch a little bit of YouTube, I think. Good morning, everybody. As you can see, I did not wash my hair last night and I should have washed my hair last night. I've just been lazy. I also woke up too late as well, so... That's a great start, but I'm just um, basically deciding whether to do any makeup or not because I kind of can't be bothered, but also I'm like, why don't you put a little bit of effort in? I got this e.l.f. Um, flawless, no, it's not, Hyde Lip Glow Liquid Filter that I've seen a lot of people use, and I really like it. My shade is quite um, dark, though, but yeah, I might buy the shade of four as well but it, i think really it was 14 pounds which i feel like is really expensive i bought it on asos and got like 20 percent off so i spent i don't know it was like a tenner basically which i thought was a bit better but did not realize it was 15 pounds you can see it's kind of a little dark for me um so i might go and buy actually the number four just to like even everything out Okay, I feel like it looks worse there, but it's like, it's dark for me, but it doesn't look ridiculous. And then once I put concealer on and stuff, it looks fine, but I just love how it gives like a little tint to your skin, and I just really like it. So, I'm definitely going to get the number four shade, 
even though I'm supposed to, like, I'm not supposed to be spending any money today. Just can't decide whether I want to do makeup or not, basically. Like, can I be bothered? Should I put an effort in because I never wear makeup? I look really dark right now. Once I put on the concealer and stuff, everything will even out. Um, but yeah, I just don't know whether I want to bother with any makeup. I also don't really have the time. I was supposed to get up early and I was going to go to my mum's early, take the dog out with my sister. And I just couldn't get up, so it didn't happen. I just got to my mum's. You know when you're driving and you have like a really close call with someone like very very close and it was I'm not gonna lie it was my fault and then you know for like five minutes after you got to turn the radio off like complete silence because you're just sitting there thinking oh my god like that was so close it was my fault I have to say I was in the wrong lane and yeah it was my fault but I had like a five minute silence because I was just like well that was a little too close but I just got to my mum's um I did do a little bit of makeup today I'm not gonna lie I don't no, I don't like it. I don't like it. So it was actually a waste of time. I just, I think because I couldn't really be bothered to do it, like my heart wasn't in it, that I just kind of rushed it. But I just got my mum, so we are going to, I'm going to drive to my sister's today so I can see my sister and my niece. I think we're going to go to an outlet, do a little bit of shopping and get some lunch. My niece wanted to go to Yo Sushi, which I've never actually been to Yo Sushi before. I feel like this camera looks really like, what is that? Is that better? Um, yeah, I've never actually been to Yo Sushi before, so I'm actually kind of excited to try that, but I'm just gonna go quickly see my dog and then drive an hour or so to my sister and hopefully drive a lot better than I was this morning. Oh, is it the sun? I thought it was something on my... Oh, I don't know. Do you guys a quick app of the day in my old room it's just a really simple plain outfit because i think it's going to be a bit chilly today but this is the plain white just basic long sleeve t-shirt from stradivarius i spoke about this in my last tour i think it was these are like the best basics ever um so hopefully this will keep me a little bit warmer today and then the same pair of jeans that i always wear these are baggy ones from h&m and they, they're the only ones i really like to be honest and then just my new balances so yeah pretty simple i'm just gonna go make myself see i'm not liking my makeup today but i'm just gonna go make myself an iced coffee for the journey because i'm trying to be good with my money save money but i can zoomed in um save money i took a packed lunch to work yesterday i'm trying to budget and just like not be so frivolous <laughs> Do you want to go for that one? Are you going to like that though? I don't know. That's funny. Oh, it's fun. I've never done this before. And I love that Jane. We pick one up. We pick one up. Ooh. That's what we got. I'm just like looking at you. Someone who said they weren't going to spend any money. I've had two coffees. I've had Yo Sushi and I've been to Abercrombie and bought a jumper that was way too much money than I should have spent. So, <laughs> successful day. I've just drove home. I feel like I'm looking a little bit worse away. I've been cold all day today. Like, it's been absolutely freezing. I've got a lot of stuff to take out of my car. This is my stuff I bought from the outlet. My mum bought me some coffee pods. I've got some donuts. And also got some ironing that my mum did for me as well. And also, I forgot to say as well, while I'm trying to budget as well, obviously I'm going away in a couple of days and then my back my car battery just died the other day i went to obviously drive and my car won't start up so i had to pay for that and get someone and pay for someone to come out and fit it so i've just you know when you feel like times there's just like certain few months that just feels like you're like pissing money like everything needs paying for and this needs money and this needs money and i just feel like i've spent so much money which is why i've been trying to budget and then I did buy two things and some sushi and a coffee. So, yeah, but I've had a really, really good day. I'm just going to get in. I actually want to take back some parcels, but I don't know whether I can be bothered to walk up the high street. It's 27, so I could do that. I'm going to bring all this in. I need to also have a shower. And we're going to wash my hair again. Probably not, to be honest with you. I'm going to show you the two things that I got from... Um, Abercrombie, I've never actually shopped at Abercrombie before, but they obviously have a shop at the outlet centre and their quality, like their sweatshirts and their hoodies and their joggers and stuff was so nice. Like this stuff is so unbelievably soft. So I did pick up a jumper for my niece. I put it away for her birthday, but honestly the feel of this, like if you like a nice 
soft, good quality sweatshirt, hoodie. Look at Abercrombie because I had no idea that they did such nice stuff, but hers are just like a oversized brown one with the little logo there. So I'm gonna put that away for her birthday. And then I've also got this, let's see, it's so soft, but I just thought this is like an oversized long cream one. The quality is unreal. And then I thought, I don't know if you can see that, actually, it's like an oversized long one. And I thought with denim, like straight jeans in the autumn with my Uggs. I was like, that is a perfect autumn outfit. Um, this was, I got it in a large, and it was originally £75. Then it went down to 62 99 and then I got an extra 30% off. So I paid like 45 quid for it, which is still quite a lot for a jumper. But I know, one, that it feels so nice. But two, I know that I will wear this constantly through the autumn time, just with like some denim jeans and my Uggs. I don't even know what it says on it. Because there was one that I wanted, and it said that it was like as seen on TikTok, so maybe it's a TikTok thing. Um, but it was like a McLaren jumper, which I really wanted, but that one was £75. I just thought that was a bit too much to spend, even though I probably would have worn it a lot. Um, it says Green Bay Rockers. I don't really know, but it feels lovely. So that's what I picked up. I'm going to try it on later, but when I take my makeup off, because I don't want to get any makeup on it. So those are the two things that i picked up from abercrombie but other than that i didn't buy anything but yeah successful day yo sushi was nice it's just i thought it was really expensive to be honest like and i didn't eat a whole lot like i'm still hungry now um i just feel like i didn't really eat a lot and it cost me like well it cost me loads of money but i did think it was quite expensive but yeah, so that was what I picked up from the outlet today. I had a really nice day. It was nice to have a day off. Like I said, I feel like I've barely booked time off of work this summer. So it was just nice to just have like wake up and know that I don't have to work and just go and have a nice girly day. It was so funny because I was sitting in, I can't remember if it was in Starbucks or, because we went to Starbucks and got coffee first. And I was just like, I love being a girl. Like have a nice shopping day, have some coffee, have some sushi, have, you know, do a bit of spending. Like I literally love being a girl. But yeah, a lovely day. I've been absolutely freezing all day. It has been so cold. I can't deal with the mess. Like everything is messy. I need to put that washing away. Um, I'm probably gonna do like a deep clean tomorrow. I need. I usually do deep cleans on a Friday. Like I like things to feel really clean on a Friday, so that then it's clean for the weekend, and I don't have to worry about doing like house stuff or um, not house stuff, like um, housework even on a weekend it's just kind of like for me i'm sorry if you can hear that by the way harrison's playing guitar i don't know if you're gonna be able to hear like it's gonna be distracting but yeah i'm gonna take off my makeup i'm gonna sort out these parcels for a return but i don't know if i'm gonna go walk and do it or maybe i'll do that tomorrow this washing i need to put it away it's been out for like two days I honestly haven't been here like to put it away so we need to do that get in the shower do some returns also need to upload a video really quickly so yeah and then i can just chill in the evening i feel like i've done so much driving today i've done like four hours of driving wait okay no that was dramatic like nearly three and a half hours of driving i thought that like really exhausts you like i feel like even though you're just sitting there driving it's like the concentrating and they're like just sitting and just just doing that i feel like really exhausts me i feel like i'm rambling now anyways i'm gonna go take off my makeup and sort myself out all right i've tried on my new job i'm not gonna lie it might actually be a little bit too big but i think the medium might have been not the right size i think with like baggy jeans and uggs you know, I don't know. I bought it now anyway, but I do really like it. It's just so soft. I'm actually debating wearing this to the airport with leggings. Um, and then I just wear like a bodysuit underneath. I don't know, but with up boots, I think it'll be cute. It'll be comfy. I feel like an American movie, like in the 90s at Christmas, I feel like there's something they would wear. I'm pretty pleased with it. Is it the right size? I don't know, but I'm not going back there. So, oh, I did actually do my returns. I'm so happy that I went and did them because I had like three returns to do. I had two different O'Poly orders. I had an ASOS order. And then I've got a Selfridges order that's getting returned, but they're coming and picking up tomorrow, which is honestly a godsend. I wish every brand would come pick up my returns. Um, but to be fair, since the post lockers, it's made it so much easier. So I just walked up the road, took some returns back. I am going to go to sleep now. I'm going to go to bed. My eyes are like... Sting, I think I'm gonna take my contact lenses out, but I'm gonna finish off this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Had a really nice day, even though I spent money when I shouldn't be spending 
my neighbor let's what it happens so i hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog please give it a thumbs up if you did and also give it a thumbs up if you enjoy vlogs i know that you enjoy them and to keep vlogging and also subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more videos from me and i will see you in my next one bye